There's something I want to talk to you about. Something important. I can never take for granted how someone might react when they learn I worship Lady Shah. Easier to just keep it a secret than take the risk. But you showed you had an open mind. I'm trying to say that you've earned my trust in a way very few ever have. I want that to mean something. I want you to know more about me, at least from what I can remember. As long as I've prayed to Lady Shah, I've wished to serve her as a dark justicia. There is scarcely a greater way to fully dedicate yourself to Lady Shah, save perhaps if you become the head of her church. To become a dark justicia is to become the Night Singer's sword arm. Her implement with which she will cast down the unbelievers and win the final battle to restore her perfect, endless darkness. It's all I ever wanted. I prayed it was my calling. But Mother forbid me from seeking to prove myself worthy of the rank. She said I was not ready. Not my mother, Mother, I should add. The Mother Superior. Head of Lady Shah's enclave in Baldur's Gate. Sometimes I wonder if she would ever deem me ready. I owe her everything, and I only wish to serve, yet she can prove... inscrutable. I don't know. Perhaps if I succeed in my mission and reach Baldur's Gate. Hope has little place amongst Lady Shah's children. It's an illusion, a distraction. But for this, I hope my time will yet come. Dark Justicias are hated by many, judged to be ruthless fanatics. Even the few who would accept a follower of Lady Shah would likely balk at a Justicia in their midst. But there's a simpler answer to your question. I simply forgot about the desire I had until I saw some things that reminded me. Now, I can't get it out of my mind. <laughs> 